Hello everyone and welcome back to the Universe Sim, our wonderful little experimental planet where I am currently trying very very hard not to have my poor little city just completely fall apart on itself. Uh, so far things have been kind of interesting. I had a whole bunch of my little nuggets as the people are called get sick because they were drinking from the lake water. Uh, I accidentally killed one by throwing a tree on top of her while trying to assist some in building a stone hut. It was slightly a traumatic moment in all of our lives and we are slowly but surely figuring out how to get all of the uh really interesting research tree like researched this is quite fascinating because i thought that it would be oh group meals look at all of this i i thought it's a little out of order to me because like you have water wills before you even have agriculture fire is over here which makes sense to me but then like we're working on again like water wills before we've been working on um like making lures and things like that so i'm not sure if i'm doing the research stuff correctly but we now have a uh casoing which is kind of interesting because it, it's needed before you can learn how to make a well then we have calendars agriculture mineral refinement and hunting coming up that hopefully everybody oh no they're drinking oh the temple no, the temple is like my place. Come on, guys. Come on, give me a little more credit over here, please. All right, it looks like they're starting to get sick. I need to use my, my wonderful creator powers. Poof, temple is fixed. Yay, come on, guys. The temple's my, my hangout. I could really use some support there. This woman got sick. Oh, yay, I have a savior achievement. Yay, all right, so everyone's happy. Everyone's doing well. Let's go ahead and speed things up a little bit. <gasps> Somebody died! Oh my gosh, that's Sasusu's body! You guys, we need to bury Sasusu, okay? Like, Sasusu is the one I accidentally hit with a tree. So, we need to figure out how to bury Sasusu. And here we have a cemetery. When a respected member of the community passes away, we cannot simply throw them in a ditch. It doesn't seem right. They deserve a proper resting place, a place where they can be forever remembered. The cemetery will help grieving families recover their happiness faster. It will also improve the smell. All right, so, oh my gosh, it's huge. Let's put the cemetery behind, boom. No. Okay, yeah, they're drinking, they're drinking bad water. You guys, I literally have a water wheel right here. And the value to the right indicates how much excess water. We have water being pumped. Oh, I can upgrade buildings. You can upgrade buildings that have the check flag next to them. Simply click on the building and select the upgrade to get started. Remember, resources will need to be delivered. However, keep in mind that upgraded buildings require refi refined or more advanced materials to be completed. So, hmm. All right. So a stone hut is about to fall apart. I haven't figured out how to get an engineer yet, but I think that's because we need to have engineers. The engineer's hut is home to all engineer nuggets. It holds the tools and knowledge necessary to build and repair structures. Engineer nuggets assigned to this building will automatically begin construction on structures that you place and repair damaged buildings over time. Awesome, so I definitely need some engineers, please. <laughs> I could really, I could really use them. Uh, there we go. I think I want to put the engineers like right here. I like how the paths naturally generate over time, depending on where the nuggets walk the most. That's really cool to me. Uh, we have the cemetery, which we kind of do need to prioritize. <laughs> There's a lot of people who support the cemetery. No, you guys, stop falling ill. I can only cure so many of you before my, like I healed the nuggets, so they're happy with me. It's giving me more supporters. Oh geez, I need to heal the stone hut because it's actually falling apart. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, hopefully, can y'all prioritize this please? I might need to use my little godly powers to move. I can pick up rocks and I can pick up trees. Oh, look at them take the cemetery. They really want to bury Sasusu. I can't blame them. I'm going to pick up a rock from over here and see if I can help a little. Okay, so I got five rocks going, and the rocks are in the mountains, so it's a little harder to reach now. Here we go. Hopefully we won't run out of the easy rocks soon. Can I get one more? There, and then I have to save my godly powers, but they just have to bring over some wood now. So we can get that up and going. And no, my archivist is sick. 
I love the little archive that they have though. And my nuggets are breeding so fast now. Like I hardly have to worry. They're just they're just zipping along with those babies. We have a lot of builders coming this way. I Oh, they're so cute. They make cute little nugget noises now. You can see where they're leaving behind a whole bunch. I, I like how they're starting to decorate, like the more we do. And apparently in the future when we complete Yay! Yeah, apparently when we complete um, some of their little quest, they'll actually have special cosmetic items they'll unlock, like fire pits and gardens, which I really want. I just want to surround my temple with gardens. I feel like I should be able to assign a nugget to be a shaman here, because we unlocked shamanism, but I haven't been able to assign a nugget to my temple, which is kind of a bummer. And this nugget is sick, but I can't cure her. There we go. Boom. All right, now she's not sick anymore. Hopefully we'll research well soon. All right, let's speed this up. Come on guys, you've got this. The engineer has just received its final touches. Thank goodness. Let's go ahead and give like my healthiest nuggets. Uh, Tiaki, you are now gonna be one of my engineers. I cannot upgrade this place, unfortunately. But hopefully now Tiaki will go around and she will actually be able to, she'll actually be able to take care of everything. And look at how the, the different buildings, oh good, so she's fixing that stone hut for me. The different houses each have like their own different little icons, which I think is really cool. And it's interesting to see which ones, like which of the nuggets have decided to live together. And the cemeteries finally died. Wow, they want everybody to go out and style. Look at this. We need a grave digger. Um, who's my unhappiest nugget? They're all super happy. Uh, let's have, let's have Chinchumbo. He'll come and be our grave digger. And it looks like we might need more water, maybe. All right, my archivist is hard at work. We've researched calendar. Look at, oh, Chinchumbo has gone to collect a body. Wow, that's kind of cool. He's wrapped it up kind of like a little mummy. Why are you? Oh my gosh. Oh, that's the little one that we couldn't find. Oh, I feel so bad. He has gathered up the two nuggets who have passed away. I feel like we have finally reached some level of, of peace. We have a little bit of resolution here. All right, what else? Can I build anything new yet? Fishing hut. Then I can also build another water pump. A forecast tower. It's only a matter of time before nuggets realize they can monitor temperature shifts and weather patterns on the planet. Oh, wow. Okay, so we have gone ahead. A nasty injury. Oh no, so somebody fell and got a nasty injury. Can we have like a doctor yet? So we cremated one body and then we went ahead and we're burying another. It's the cycle of life, my friends. What? Wow! There's actually like a little grave marker and everything. And then you can see how old they were or like when they died and the cause of death. That is fascinating. And then what does this, what does this have to do? Huh. And then I guess like one is just to like cremate. That's so interesting. So, all right, now we have, oh, and then, oh, wait, he fell? Okay, uh, boink. There you go. Then Nugget believes in me because I fixed her broken leg now. And again, I love seeing the path develop the more my Nuggets walk through things. So, huh, all right, what else can I have them do now? Well, oh, we can have a hospital. Oh, that's so cool. We already have the eatery and the engineers and the cemetery. And now we have a well. Yes, please. I really need a well. Uh, what did it say about a well? Hang on real quick. Wells are automatically filled by water pumps. The further away you place a well from a water pump, the more resources it will cost. Hmm, so you know, I think there's a little lake right over here. Maybe I could, I wonder, like a well. 21, 20, 20, 21. Hmm, because I, I feel like I need, so this is how much you would water you would get from it well let's plant a well plant let's build a well 
constructing no 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 don't build their don't destroy their houses just put it next to their houses so let's try building a well here they're having a lot of babies they're gonna need to expand their houses soon if they keep that up uh and then i feel like we should put another like another water pump maybe over here and then we can plant or plant we can build another well like over here so things aren't quite so difficult for my little nuggets all right forecast tower let's see they can monitor the temperature shifts and weather patterns on the planet instead of always having to carry an umbrella as a precaution they'll soon discover seasons which will give them information on what to expect in the coming months hmm i don't know if i need to build that for them just yet i do want another well plop down right about here and i do want them to have a hospital because that sounds really important if you ask me and i want them to build it right over here so all right come along little ones it's so dark i can't really see what you're up to but hopefully this will get done soon yeah they're hauling stuff they're busy they're busy busy little bees and we should have agriculture underway soon right now we're still like strictly gatherers just kind of only focusing on doing a little bit of gathering here a little bit of gathering there there's a lot of fruit but i feel like i don't have a lot of people assigned to go collect it because i don't think i can assign anybody to go collect it just yet so we'll just have to kind of wait on that i have my archivist who does all the auto saving and she's really cool i like her let's see yeah and we're done over here so we don't really need the grave digger at the moment so i'm gonna unassign him so he can go do something else while researching ag agriculture yumboki discovered seedlings during an intense thumb wrestling tournament and the well has just received its final touches oh thank goodness can you guys stop getting sick every two seconds now because that would be amazing a water well provides nuggets with clean drinkable water the closer well is placed to the closer the well is placed to the natural water source the faster it will replenish the number above the uh the building indicates water refill rate nuggets drink water from the ocean if there's no wells around there's a high chance of getting sick from that so i hope okay so it looks like it the well will refill kind of slowly but it'll get there eventually because it's kind of a good distance away from other water. All right, we have agriculture. Can I make a farm? Please. You guys need to eat. Let's see. Oh, I can make a farm. Farms allow your civilization to become more self-sufficient and rely less on scavenging food from the land. Random bear attacks and reckless tasting of strange and potentially deadly plants may soon be a thing of the past. Farms are made up of farm plots, which can be used to grow crops for your civilization. Sounds fantastic. We're going to actually try. Oh, you can have like grassland farm. Yeah, let's put a grassland farm right down here, right behind all of these houses, right next to the well. I think that's going to go well. Oh, we have a special event. I wonder what's going on. Oh, that's so cool. And now we have more of them getting married. Hopefully, can I prioritize this? Yeah prioritize that can i help them we have i want to help them build stuff i want to prove that i am a good a good little god for them so let's see um uh, no somebody got sick dang it come on i just installed all of these wells what are you doing they're thirsty the water doesn't refresh that quickly well actually let's see if i can help out oh two people are sick can i help out with the hospital Oh, it's done! What? The hospital is complete! That is so cool! Alright, we now have the little hospital done. It looks really awesome. Who should be... Maybe Mboki. Uh, stamina, eh? By might. Let's see. Nuggets by character traits. What? Lazy. Oh, there's different character traits. Neutral character traits. Some are lazy, some are nibblers. Um, let's go ahead and have a bohi. Where'd you go? She's going to come over and she's going to be our doctor. And it looks like somebody is already coming to a, the healing spot. <gasps> Look at the cute little garden. Oh, I love that. There's like a little lily pad garden inside there. That's so cool. And there's a brand new stone hut. What? 
look, we have another little cluster of stone huts being built. They seem to really enjoy building them in threes so they have some neighbors. Dude, you're gonna die. We have a very sickly nicheling. Or nicheling? <laughs> Nugget. There we go. Who was ignoring any any need for help. And now we have a sickly nugget over here. She looks way green. And oh, look at that cool little little outfit that we have. You're awesome. I love this little area. What a cool outfit. My insides feel like they're turning into sand. No herbs to harvest. Huh. Well, I'm just going to go ahead and heal her then for now. What is this? Pardon, pardon the telescope? There has to be a better way to chop trees. Uh, how is he using a telescope? While researching a mineral refinement, Wamaro discovered sanding after running into a tree. Oh, that's kind of funny. All right, so our farm in the grassland is almost done being researched. I want to see how that goes. What are we researching? Material refinement right now. We have a water well up and going. We have another well up and going. And now we're going to assign a nugget. Let's pick one with really, really good stamina. Or I guess I guess we would want like really good strength. Oh my gosh. Um, is this strength? Yeah, by their might. So let's go with Kirk. And we're gonna choose a crop. <gasps> oh my gosh. Uh we only have the bloody fruit. Oh wait, can I do herbs? How do you discover them? Oh my gosh, what the heck? Okay, we're gonna choose this crop, which I don't really wanna do, but I didn't notice, what was that like, archive? What was that interesting news thing, farm? There we go. Nuggets love two things above all else, eating and sleeping. Sorry to hear you didn't make the list. <laughs> Anyway, in order to satisfy their first love, they have developed a way in which to grow food more consistently. Agriculture has since swept the land. Farms are where all the magic happens. It begins with the planting of crops. Every crop has a preferred biome, so try to match the crop to the particular biome the farm is situ situated in. Growing crops outside of their preferred biomes will result in water usage and decreased food yield. So you can help farmers discover new crops by identifying them in the world and dropping them onto farms with your telekinesis powers. <gasps> That's so cool. I want to do that. Forget the weird plant. There's this really cool amount of baroa fruit. Let me go ahead. Wow, you really can help out. Okay. I didn't realize that I could do that. Okay, where is it? Where'd the food go? Where'd that big pile of food go? No. Okay, there's something over here. We have a juicy acorn. Do I have it? I'm using my telekinesis power. I feel very devil's lettuce. I feel very gypped right now. Uh, Kirk needs your help at the farm. Dear creator, we've been growing the same crop over and over again, which is getting a little boring. You don't really have, uh, you can't really make a fruit salad with only one type of fruit, and eating so much bloody diarrhea fruit is causing everyone to experience some adverse effects. There must be some other types of crops around. If you can hear me, please help us to discover something super tasty and relatively safe for consumption. Collect and drop new crop types using the levitate creator power, and we could get scarecrows. Oh, I wish we could actually get those things because it would be so much fun. So let's see. This is my telekinesis power, isn't it? It is. So I don't want that fruit. So let's try to find some fruit. I don't want to destroy them. I want to discover there's a turtle. I could try dropping a turtle. Um, yeah, I wanna I wanna discover some new things. Is that a turtle too? Yeah, there's turtles and cactuses. I already seem to have destroyed two entire like two entire crops. So what about this one? Alright, there's a crop over here. Devil's lettuce. So when I do that, it just like destroys it entirely. Oh man, so you're supposed to pick it up, collect and drop new crop types with your levitate power. Hmm. Oh, oh, this is interesting. I picked up a thing. Is this just a cactus? Hello? What about a cactus? Did that do anything? 
Anything at all? No. Fooey, all right. Well, there's a really, like, a huge collection of really cool looking fruits. I need to figure out how to collect them? Huh. All right, well, let's see. Oh, what about this? Can I fly over a little faster? What about these? I want these fruit. How do you collect them without destroying them? Hmm. Oh, there you go. You like have to get in really close. Okay. All right, I've got this. I've got this. Guys, guys, look what I found. Here. Yay! Now they believe in me. <laughs> the faith has increased. There's some new crops. And we can now grow these mandala fruit. Oh, that makes me so happy. All right, so we're growing some really nasty fruits, but we have some new ones coming in. Faith has increased in me. Uh, I'm very happy about all of this. <laughs> and I figured out how to, how to gather the plants, but you really have to get in there and be very delicate with it. So, all right, we continue to grow and prosper and expand ourselves. I'm not really sure how we're going, to be completely honest, but I have an engineer who is taking care of the buildings. I have an eatery set up. We seem to be doing fairly well at it. I can't, oh, somebody is sick, but we do have a doctor. So hopefully they'll, they'll go over to the doctor at some point. The wells are beginning to fill up. I think we're getting into the swing of things finally, guys. And there's still a lot more that could be researched, like grass weaving, which I think would make things a little easier for people to carry. Pulley systems, mortar and pestle, hmm. Even education. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that we can still try researching and who knows when they'll decide they want to start exploring the entire rest of the planet. But we're moving into our second winter. Hopefully everybody will make it just fine and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.